we laid the tracks for understanding what data is and where it lives. Now it's time to speak the language of data itself. Welcome to mile three that is basic clause, the real building blocks of SQL. In this, we have five sections. Section one, about SQL journey. This is the journey number two of SQL level one. We are going to cover about SQL basic clause. Section two, about today's journey. We'll cover two essential clauses that form the foundation of every SQL query, select and from. Section three, basic clause. SQL clause is keywords of SQL language to communicate with database. Today, we are going to learn the most basic SQL clause. Just like the alphabet starts with A, your SQL starts here with select and from. from. Select clause used. T lists the columns you want to view from a table. From clause tells SQL where to look, the name of the table or view. Section four, select clause. The SQL select statement is used to fetch the data from a database table, which returns this data in the form of a result table. And these result tables are called result sets. To display all the columns of a table, use the asterisk character asterisk. If you want to fetch all the fields available in the column, then you can use the following syntax. Select asterisk from employee section five from clause. The from clause specifies the source tables and views from which data is to be read. The from clause is the first clause that the database system looks at when it parses the SQL statement. If we get the from clause wrong, the SQL statement will always return the wrong results. It's the from clause that produces the tabular structure, the starting set of data on which all other operations in a select statement are performed. If you want to display all the fields available in the table, then you can use the following syntax. You've just learned how to tell your database what you want and where to get it from. That's a big step. Next stop is mile four. Please follow our page to travel with us on SQL Journey. Very soon you will reach to mile four. If you want to enroll for SQL Journey, please register on our website. Link is mentioned in the caption. You can also contact us on given numbers.